boys and girls it's 2024 and we are in the age of content 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 everyone's making content everyone even you so let's make sure that we're making the best content possible starting with our audio welcome to jt talks tech where we will dive into the nitty-gritty of content creation and gaming talk tech and tips today we're tackling a crucial aspect of any content audio so if you're ready to upgrade your audio game let's roll so first things first, you need to know that there are different kinds of microphones and they each come with their own lists of pros and cons. First off, we'll talk about condenser versus dynamic mics. Condenser mics are generally used in more sound treated spaces as they're more sensitive to sound and will pick up a lot more ambient noise from your room like reverb or an air conditioner or a fan that you have running. Dynamic mics on the other hand are much better at isolating noise and just pulling your voice so if you stream in a room with other people or you record in a not very well sound treated room a dynamic mic may be a better choice for you and the next distinction to make is going to be xlr versus usb mics this really just boils down to how much equipment you already have or want to buy it used to be much more of a consideration of quality, but nowadays there are USB microphones that sound incredible, don't cost an arm and a leg, and won't require you to have an entirely separate interface to plug that microphone into. Now that we know a little bit about microphone types and their strengths and weaknesses, let's talk about how to determine which to choose based on your content setup. And the reason that I said before audio is so crucial, it's because it's half of the equation in any content that you're making. Literally half, there is audio and visual. We all know we want fancy cameras and a cool studio and setup and stuff, but if you neglect audio, you're neglecting half of the viewer's experience. Not to mention that the two halves actually complement and enhance each other. Anyway, back to choosing whatever mic is right for you. The obvious thing to think about first, in my opinion, is your budget. Are you just starting out or maybe you're just a casual gamer who wants a halfway decent microphone? Maybe you've been doing it for a little while and you want an upgrade? Or maybe you're a pro who wants to absolutely max out the quality that they can achieve. After you've decided what you might be willing to spend on a microphone and any potential peripheral equipment required for that microphone, the next thing to do is to address your setup. Like I said earlier, is it loud? Do you share a room? Maybe you only stream or maybe you only record podcasts or videos like this. Break down what qualities you would prioritize in a microphone for your space and then use your budget combined with your knowledge of microphones and everything we learned in the first step together to help guide you in the right direction. Me personally, I use a Shure MV7 plugged into an Elgato Wave XLR and I love it. The MV7 is actually a really cool hybrid XLR or USB. I could switch it at any time. I was using it as a USB before and uh, the cable broke. So instead of buying another USB cable, I, I bought an XLR interface. So Don't be like me. But the Elgato Wave XLR actually allows me to use Elgato's Wavelink software, which allows me to create submixes and control all of my streaming audio through this software, which is really, really incredible and a great tool to have for any creator. Fun side note about that, actually, you don't need just the Wave XLR if you own an Elgato microphone at all or the Elgato Stream Deck Plus, you have access to that software. Just thought I'd let you know. Right, so now that your head's proper spinning, and you're already dreading trying to research what microphone to buy, let me throw out a few personal suggestions just to ease your mind. Like I said, I use a Shure MV7, and I love it, uh, but a lot of creators really love the Shure SM7B. You see it in podcasts all the time. It's a little expensive, but it's an excellent microphone, tried and true. And to be honest, that's where my recommendation for XLR microphones stops. Unless you're really at the top end of content, there are some USB microphones that sound incredible. Firstly, I would recommend the Blue Yeti or Blue Yeti X as I've used both of those in the past. They're great microphones. I would also recommend the HyperX Quadcast. I have a lot of friends who use this microphone and they love it. Both of these microphones have gain knobs, easy mute options. They're really great for a simple microphone that's just plug and play. And if you're looking for a little bit of a middle ground between professional and gamer RGB USB mic realm, the Elgato Wave 3 is a highly regarded USB microphone that, as I mentioned before, also gives you access to the Elgato Wavelink software. I'll also put links to all these things below the video if you want to go check them out for yourself. All right, moving on. Now that you've picked your microphone, this section is 
optional. And I don't wanna bog you down with a whole tutorial in this video right now. So I'll just give a couple quick examples of things you can do to optimize your microphone. Maybe I can do that in a later video. If you guys wanna see that, comment down below and I'd be more than happy to go into more detail about settings and stuff like that. All right, one last thing before I get into this. I'm a huge proponent of being your own problem solver and teacher, even if it just means using Google. Learning how to research new things rather than just going on in life without that knowledge is a valuable skill that I want to try to instill in all of my viewers, if it's not already there. That being said, ways that you can optimize your audio. First thing, listen back to your mic. It might sound dumb, but most creators simply don't do this. And it is a very easy way to find very obvious issues that are usually very easy to fix. Next, generally err on the side of less gain and microphone closer to your mouth, than more gain and microphone further from your mouth. When you crank up that gain, you're gonna start picking up background noise and you're just gonna lose that certain level of quality. Here's an easy one. Double check your polar pattern. Again, it sounds simple, but if you have a microphone that lets you toggle it on board, it's easy for it to get bumped and maybe changed. So just make sure that it's set correctly. Also, not all mics are created equal. So make sure that you're talking into the correct side or end of your microphone. I'd also like to throw on a little note on the end to experiment with your settings. Not every room is the same. Not everyone's voice is the same. Not everyone's preferences are the same. There is no one like in gamer terms, like God sense for microphone settings. Find what works for you and your setup and your content. And last but not least, here are your scavenger hunt items for today. Pop filters and VSTs or audio plugins. Yep, I'm giving you homework. Go practice how to find the answers you need and exercise that beautiful creative brain of yours. Cutie. All right, gang, that wraps up today's JT Talks Tech on microphones. Remember, the right microphone is key to unlocking crystal clear audio for all of your content. If you made it to this point of the video, clearly you enjoyed the video or at least found the guide helpful. So it would really mean a lot to me if you would consider liking the video, subscribing to the channel, and comment down below your go-to microphone setup. I also have a Twitch if you'd like to catch me live and chat with me there. I'll be streaming every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday at 5 p.m. Pacific. We'll just be hanging out, chatting, or gaming. Feel free to pop in and ask any questions you might have. Until next time, keep creating, keep innovating. See you later. Cool! <gasps> Feel like a billion bucks! Yeah! This room's kind of cool, I like it, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs>